Hey everybody, we are back, and um, I'm gonna transition to this one first. This is kind of our like, since Cliff's not back yet, this is our musicless uh, Ponyville scene. Uh, we just leveled up, and and um, and uh, Joe was explaining to us, and we figured while we're waiting, might as well explain to you guys. Joe, explain to the to the people who are listening at home in My Little Pony: Tales of Equestria, the tabletop RPG, the the storytelling game. Um, what does leveling up mean? So normally you level up at the end of an adventure or session. But since this is a one shot, we're doing a halfway point and then possibly one for the finale. Whoa, uh, I got to interrupt you there bit. for a second because we just got a massive tiger on the roof again. Gave us 500 bits. Thank you, sir. And he said everyone, he just got, he just bought everyone a uh, a token of friendship. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And now, so you guys know, we're about to learn how to level up, and uh, we are now like a little over 200 uh, bits. 200 bits, or a little over two dollars donations away from um, away from a second level up. But uh, go ahead, Joe. Sorry to interrupt you. Oh, the meter got filled up on my screen. Yeah, on my screen. Strange. It's not on here. <laughs> yeah. You know what? It might be not Ooh. taking into account that um. The oh, it is, it is. So we got it. Yay! We get a, another level. That's Solid two levels, planet. guys. We got, we, oh man, uh, this when is you so level cool. up, you can raise one talent. I mean, one attribute, either body, mind, or charm, by one die type. You then get to raise every talent that you have used in the adventure by one die type. Then you have the choice of either gaining a new talent at a D4 or raising a talent you haven't used by a die type. And if your body and or mind changes, remember to up your stamina since your stamina is the sum of the two die types. And everybody is going to get two more tokens of friendship for the level. Wow. This is Normally so there's a lot more. Thanks, Sarah. You're so awesome. That's Tiger on the Roof. That's my sister-in-law. Oh, Oh, thank you. That's the most awesome. It's even better. Ah. So we are we are loaded down with tokens of friendship, guys. So it's time. I just paper cutted myself. It's time to start like throwing them at stuff. Um, but yeah. But then I break my camera. (laughs) Chuck them at things. All right. Cool. Okay. Well, what I'm going to say is so that we don't have to wait for too long, I'm going to say we'll, uh, Cliff will jump in when it's time to jump in. He understands leveling up and everything, I, I know. So, um, yeah. so we'll just let him know that we got the extra level and he can handle it on Willa uh, and he can jump in. We'll, we'll get it moving. We were headed to the Everfree Forest. That's where it was, right? Yes. Yeah. Everfree Forest. All right. Let me transition to our spooky Everfree Forest scene. Dee 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 dee. Wow, this is yes. I love the music. It's so very loud. Owie. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let me bring, that whispering too. bring it down a little bit. Yeah, okay. Right? Do you you play that uh, on Twitch, right? Yeah. Not like actually on Roll20. That's nice. All right, so here we are, Everfree Forest. Take it away, Joe. All right. So the carriage deposits you at the edge of the Everfree Forest. Um, It doesn't want to go too far over because landing on the other side didn't look optimal. Oh, okay. All right, And it is dark. The the moon is still up. Uh, It has been some hours yet. Probably not yet dawn, but with nobody to raise the sun. The moon is going to stay up for a while. <laughs> Sorry, Zippy, I see you're great. <laughs> Watch out for Shia LaBeouf. Yeah. <laughs> Actual cannibal, cannibal Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> yeah. Yep. That's my okay. husband. All right, all right. <laughs> so all right, guys. First thing, everybody gets to make a mind test to help resist the uh, 
unsettling atmosphere of the Everfree Forest. Oh, good. Okay. Here we go. The difficulty is a four. Two. <laughs> it's a good thing I just boosted Ooh, that. I probably should switch. Four. I, which one was it? Mind. Mind. I'm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna spend a token of friendship to reroll mine. Okay. Well, getting a two, I would uh, suggest you do the same. <laughs> I, I got, got seven. Shia Hoof. Oh my gosh. Shia Hoof. Nice. <laughs> nice zippy toe tag. You uh. You win the. So far, you have the uh, best comment in the chat trophy. <laughs> Um, is it possible? Uh, you know, can I just? I'm gonna spend an. Uh, I'm gonna spend three just to succeed. Just to I rolled get... another two. So. I see that. <laughs> no, don't spend all three. I'll give you at least one. No, I'll give you one. Oh, yeah. thank you. There well, we go. The effect, if you want to live with it, is yeah, just that like going that. to be downgraded on the next task. Mm. No, no, no. I need. I need pristine need cupcakes. Baked out of you, so uh, have normal cupcakes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll on the next task, one. we could just yeah, I will. Yeah. three, and then we will automatically succeed. So, yeah, that'd be great. You're good, however, you guys want to handle it. I'm, I'm up for it either way. We took care of it. I already subtracted the tokens of friendship from all of us, so uh, cool. <laughs> thank you. It's been Let's done. Do it. So, it sounds thank like you. there's a group huddle, and uh, yeah. you know, don't let it get to you. It's all right, yeah. yeah. We, uh, we land and it's like, okay, guys, have fun. It's saving the world. And Whisk is just like, ha. Ah. Dusty <laughs> Rune, we are now in the Everfree Forest. By the way, we filled up the meter right before we started. So you get a second level um, on top of the one we got naturally. Mm -hmm. If Dusty Rune can hear us. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear yes. you now. Okay. There we go. You heard that you heard oh, that you yeah. got a second level, right? Yes. All right, so that's two levels. So, you you can handle that and um yeah. All right, so traveling through the Everfree Forest. It is dark. A lot of the trees look like they are uh, scary monsters reaching out to grab you. Uh, it starts to rain mm. and thunder and lightning. The oh flashing. God, yep, the flashing of the lightning makes it a lot more eerie than it would normally be if it was a sunny lit day, but it's not. I am going to get the, out of Wash my... the dust out of the air. Wash the I'm going to get my raincoat out and I'm going to get my little plastic baggie <laughs> out and give it to Whiskey Cream so she can put her cupcakes in them so they oh. don't get soggy. Thank you. <laughs> Good thinking. And as you are traveling in the direction the of the gem, the trees start to be covered with web. Oh, Scarce at first. Yeah. And then it gets more prominent. Uh, stronger strands instead of broken strands you start to pass. You look nervous, uh, Dr. Cheerheart. Is everything trees. okay? <laughs> they have eight legs. That's not right. It's creepy. Uh -oh. well, I don't know. The webbing's kind of pretty, You're especially with the rain. Yeah. Why not on fire? Get rid of it. <laughs> well, we can't set the forest on fire. Yeah. No, just the webs. It's not a just good idea. Just the webs. Well, it's also okay. raining, so yes. It's probably better just to try not to touch them. Yeah. We can make it. <laughs> it's gonna be gross. And then a shadow passes off to the side, and you hear the skittering of legs. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we oh. should uh, hoof it. <laughs> yeah, I will stay with Doctor Cheerheart and um, encourage her to keep m moving forward. Yeah, I keep I help you with that, and I keep pushing her. <laughs> you can do it. I have to. Oh God, it's gonna get in my face. It's gonna be so real. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you. Are cupcake. you attempting to hurry through? Uh, yes. Yeah. But, yeah. Now that the okay. spiders are. Yeah. Hey, there, there's gonna, there's gonna be spiders, and there's gonna be two. There's, that's four too many legs. That's not right. <laughs> All right. It's just not right. So, running through, uh, <laughs> with the rain and the darkness of the forest itself, uh, visibility is not the best. So you start running through strands of web <laughs> as you guys are 
hurrying up without being able to see him and dodge around him. So I'm going to need a body test from everybody to not get caught. Can I um, can I use cloud wrangling to try to clear the weather? Uh, yes, you may. Right. In here, the difficulty is going to be higher, though, so it's going to be a six. All right. I'm going to use my uh, unicorn horn, oh, no. <laughs> which is up to a D10 now, uh, so to provide a very nice bright beam of light for Dr. Cheerheart to follow yes. um, and clearly see the path. Am I just rolling okay. cloud wrangling, or is there an attribute associated with that? Cloud wrangling, in this case, it would probably be mined as well. Oh, nice. No. Double D10s. Six. I'm cool with that. I, I rolled a one, so I'm going to go ahead and um, do a re-roll. I'm going to take... Oh, <laughs> I'm, I re-rolled mine as well. I'm so, I'm so busy helping Dr. Cheerheart out that I totally missed the one that was right in front of me, and now I'm stuck. <laughs> <laughs> what did we need to to beat it? Because I got a six. Six. Uh, uh, yes. if I, um... I, will, I will help out Glitter Gem if she gets stuck. And I um oh. I I need to uh I want to reroll as well. If I sp if I spend a token With... to reroll, do I reroll both of them? Sorry. Um... Sure. Uh, however, with the the cloud wrangling, what was your cloud wrangling? I have cloud wrangling ten and mine ten. You D10. you got a six on the cloud wrangling though, right? No, I got a two and a three. Oh. So I okay. wanted to so, yeah. re-roll One that. token will let you re-roll both. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I rolled a nine on my illuminate the path and run through um, without, you know, getting entangled. The illumination and like the cloud ring. <laughs> oh my god, two out. tens! I got two double tens! tens. Wow. That drops the, the requirement to get through the spider webs down to a three, however, since well, you can avoid a lot more of them. I'm still stuck. I'll uh, help her out. <laughs> I'll walk over and be like, it's okay, I'll get you out. And then I'll start pulling. These, these webs are so sticky. I know. So, well, so Nightshine gets up and... pull her out easily. Get me out, 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 get me out of here. <laughs> yeah, and I, I tell everybody while you're handling that, I, I say, uh, guys, this, uh... This rain is really getting on my nerves. I'll be back, and I shoot up into the air and try to, and I clear all the rain clouds and come back down. And now there's a nice starry sky, which is exactly how I perform best. Yes. Uh, how I perform. You managed to pull out <laughs> glitter gem from the web. It's not too hard with some help, you know, pulling, pulling the webbing around. However, the commotion has attracted some attention, and you guys notice a very large spider. Oh, great. Wow walking Hello into there, the Spider. path ahead of you. I, I freak the ever-loving crap out and start <laughs> screaming. I'm not going to scream into my mic because I love all you guys. <laughs> Thank you. It's like, yeah! um, I'm going to use my uh, force field to uh, try to put like a nice barrier between Dr. Cheerheart and the spider to try to make her feel maybe less terrified. And okay. I'm going to help because that's one of my new skills. I don't know if I can actually force help. field. Yeah. You can. Awesome. You guys can both roll and take the higher. So your force field plus your mind. I or um. Force field and mind take the higher, highest single die roll between the two of you. Okay. I. I don't have talk to animals, but can I try like talking to the spider and being like. Hi, Mr. Spider! You and... can. Okay. Uh, it would be charm. Cool. And since you don't have the skill, the mm -hmm. difficulty will go up. Okay. Um, I got a ten. Yeah, I only got a three. I was going to do a friendship token to re-roll, but that ten is as high as I can roll. So I think we'll, we'll take that. Okay. Glitter Jim can assist me in. We'll, uh... The, my... My force field light from my uh, horn is a uh, kind of a strong blue color. What what color is glitter gems? Mine is iridescent sparkles. Okay, so it's an iridescently sparkling blue, uh, blue barrier to hide Doctor Cheerheart from seeing the visage of the spider. Yes. I got a natural. Oh, it's there! Oh my god! Oh my god! 
and I just like follow my kind of like follow my haunches and start screaming, just like crying, screaming. It's uh, kind of with the six, you understand uh, not words, obviously, because a spider isn't speaking words, but you understand the body language, and it mm -hmm. is definitely advancing at you guys with a hunger. I offer it a good big old cupcake. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome! Yes! Oh my gosh, that's uh, awesome! I love this it. Roll me <laughs> charm plus your baking, or charm okay. and charm your plus I'm, baking. I'm giving you a friendship point for that one because you're you're trying to make it stop for meeting us, and I yeah. And like, yeah, she's got to make it eat something else. Yeah. Make sure it's caramelized so it charm. gets gooey and it's and baking. <laughs> so so cool. Mom, um, baking. I have. All right, so five, because baking was my highest. But you guys all gave me. I gave you. Gave you token of I gave you one, I and gave... Jules gave you one, so you can at least ro roll a d20. Okay. Yeah. Because there's no way I'm going to let that cupcake fail. Four. <laughs> Four. <laughs> Whoa. Um, can I throw in one one as well? Is it too late for that? It's too late for that. Well, I'll, for another reroll? Yeah, for reroll. For reroll. Reroll re re that re 20. Yes. Right. You can throw in uh, two more. Somebody can throw in a total of two more for another 20 reroll. I'll throw in another. Or a third one just to have it succeed. Cassie I'll... and Paige gives two. Oh. Anybody got a third one? one? Come on. Do you All right, Jules. Jules, that's three. Yeah, you got okay. it. You, okay. make it. you make it. You make it. <laughs> we just blew through five. So yeah, bad with did. like. <laughs> I'm sitting at a bunch of these, uh, like, but I want to see what happens when the dice roll. Yeah, I am. Um... The level success just doesn't sound as much fun. <laughs> well, we're, I know, we're, but we're hoarding spiders. these tokens, Cliff. <laughs> yeah, we are. I, I had ten. <laughs> so we have, how to have how all does, the friendship tokens. How does Whisked Cream offer this cupcake? So as I see the spider coming towards it, and I'm naive, so I immediately like, hi, Mr. Spider, and I. I quickly, talk to it. I quickly just like go in my satchel and I pull out this big muff, like this big cupcake, and I go, "Do you want a cupcake?" And I hold it up to it. Hey, you got there we go. Stop. Tea cut. Token Thank of friendship you. for everybody. Just Hi. yeah. Yay. Thank you. Save the rainbow equine race. I love it. Um. So the spider advances. Uh, yeah. The two uh, mouth legs are, are clicking yeah. around the dramatically, animals. and one, the foreleg reaches out uh, threateningly, but then pokes into the muffin and yeah. pulls it back. <laughs> I hope you like it. I baked it with kindness and love, and, and plus it matches your eyes. All 18 of your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> it steps aside and starts eating the muffin. Okay, guys, let's go. Poor guy was just hungry after all. Oh, let's just go. Well, it's eating that. It's not going to eat us. And if, it, if it's if it's caramelized, it, it might get kind of sticky. In and, the and, middle, and, in the middle of Doctor Here Cheerheart down. talking, I place my hooves on her and slowly walk her away. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, come on. You There's guys... way worse stuff to worry about out here than just a bunch of animals. Yeah. <laughs> Start heading through. Uh, a few more spiders approach with cream during the path. <laughs> <laughs> I I have plenty of cupcakes. <laughs> oh, gosh. Good. They do Save seem happy the power about of flower. You give one spider a cupcake, they just come up crawling out of the woodwork. <laughs> Get it? Yeah. I can't yeah. love spiders, but... <laughs> Yeah, each one walks up and I hand them a muffin or a cupcake and I'm just like, hi, I love eating you guys. It's depending on whatever, how big the spideys are, right? Yeah. One's really fluffy and I'm like, oh, you're so fluffy. <laughs> just spiders the munchies. Oh my God. As you get further through the Everfree Forest, Glitter Gem, you notice um, a few quartz crystals on the, the ground ahead of you. Uh, small ones, not mm -hmm. dust, but not large. Uh, okay. They seem to be a few here, and then up ahead, there's a few more. And uh, 
you find one little grouping of them next to a print. Uh, looks like a canine print of some sort. Hmm. I think that somebody is leaving a trail of gems. We should pick them up. So we can give it back to oh. them? Yes. That's no. a good idea. If these are these are similar to the uh, to the gem that's doing all the nasty stuff, right? No. That is blue. Oh. Uh, you're oh. the geologist, uh, so I'll start picking them up as we go with my uh, telekinesis and uh, stowing them in <clears throat> one of the pockets of my I, of my pack backpack. My backpack saddle. <laughs> Back saddle. <laughs> Are you talking about your uh, saddlebags? <laughs> yes, yeah. saddlebags. Yes, that's the right word. With no saddle, though. But I don't have a saddle. Saddlebag you know, pack back. Saddle. Yeah. yeah. Saddlebag backpack. Yeah. The uh, the Haunch pack. prints become uh, more regular. There was some mud that the first one stepped into. Now that the rain has stopped, it is drying. But there is more uh, dusty prints being left ahead too. It seems to be coming from uh, three different creatures together. Only the the courts seem to be next to one particular set of prints. Okay. As though that mm. one is leaking courts yes. for some reason. That one is, Wait a minute. That, that one is leaving their courts all over the place. Why in the world would they do that? I know. Yes, we're definitely taking them. And then when we find them, we can give it back. All right, I am going to think very carefully uh, with my keen knowledge of history to think of a creature that leaves quartz in a, its trail. Give me a roll with keen history and mind. Uh, this right. difficulty it, would be a four. I rolled a four. Can? Oh, you already got good. I was just going to say, can I use gemology if you needed help, but I think you've got it, so never mind. There is a uh, gemology. Not necessarily that leaves quartz, but mixing with the canine prints and the fact that there are quartzes, these uh, one creature comes into mind as a group of creatures called diamond dogs that tend to hunt for gems. They are very mm. greedy and they try to get as many gems as they can. I think we might be uh, following the trail of some diamond dogs. They're particularly greedy about gathering gems. Maybe they, maybe they've uh, acquired the comet uh, as part of their uh, their gem greed. I'm not sure yeah. how they would have pulled it out of the sky, but hey, it's a lead. You got me. Lassos. It sure does seem like an awfully big job for a group like them. They're usually pretty small time. You're a thinker, aren't you, Whisk Cream? <laughs> <laughs> My mind is six. I recently upgraded it, but yes. <laughs> well, they did step in some mud, and it rained. started raining after you got here. That's, yes. tr that's true. Briefly. And so they are going in the direction you're going. Ooh. They, they might have seen it. They might have known about it, and they just want it. They probably have gem scents, mm -hmm. just like me. Well, we better get to it before they do, if they weren't the ones who did it in the first place. Good thinking. So, um, I'm going to yeah, like, focus in on with my little, uh, um, amplification device and make sure we're going in the right direction still. Yeah, and I'll, I'll look at it and adjust right it direction. and make sure it's working. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> yeah, yeah kind of like focus in, yeah. It, you are going in the right direction. They Focus seem it. to be going in the right direction. And they seem to have about a half hour lead on you. Let's go faster. Oh, can I fly uh, ahead? In a... You can fly ahead? Yeah. I want to I want to take kind of a, a high kind of flight so maybe they won't see me, but I, I would like to follow the tracks and fly ahead and see where they are and what they're doing. Don't go too Give far. Give me a fly skill and a mind roll. Yeah, well, you just named my two best dice. <laughs> awesome, awesome. We're looking at a seven. Seven, you see uh, on the other side of the Everfree Forest, a group of three diamond dogs, and they seem to be, uh, one of them is 
motioning to the others and pointing ahead, uh, where up ahead you see um, kind of a trail leading up into the mountains. Hmm. There's no spiders in the mountains. Let's go to the mountains. Okay. All right. I, 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 so they're headed up into up a trail into the mountains. You say? Yes. All right. Well, they're heading towards the trail. They're just leaving the Everfree Forest at the moment. All right. Ah, diamond dogs. I didn't expect to find any of them out here. Well, they're headed out of the forest. They're headed up to a, the, a mountain just outside of the forest. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Well, um, we should be careful. They can be dangerous. Dusty, do they just hoard the, fruit, the gems, or do they eat them? What? Uh, uh, I think uh, typically only dragons eat gems. Mm. But I don't know for sure. I think they usually like to uh, put them on their collars and such. Oh. As decorations, they love to decorate everywhere. Sometimes when the light hits just right, they do look exactly like sparkly diamonds and oh. it would be so wonderful to have one with like gems all over i would decorate it with all of the colorfulest gems and it would be named jim and yeah it would be amazing hmm. well i really hope that they didn't use the comet gem that would be bad hold on to that quartz by the way those can be used in making uh telescope lenses Ooh. i'll pick out the best ones so you can make or somebody can. All right. We're headed out of the forest. <laughs> I can make a cake that looks like a telescope. <laughs> yes. <laughs> My birthday's coming up. Be, yeah, I was going to say, it may not be usable, but... <laughs> Getting out of the forest in a hurry is going to cost everybody one stamina. Okay. Oh, really? Worth it. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> That's reminder, guys rush. a reminder, by the way, guys, that um, that to upgrade your stamina, b what your current mind and body are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mine's really high right now. Yeah. My stamina. Stan I stamina. Have my stamina. Stan stamina. 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 <laughs> stamina. I do have pony balm in case we need something like that. Oh, me too. I. I got it in my saddlebag. I didn't uh, equip myself. <laughs> That's all right. I probably, I probably just have baking stuff anyway. Yeah. <laughs> probably. Got tubs of frosting and butter sticks, flour, <laughs> eggs. <laughs> Lots of cream. Hey, eggs make great projectiles and can blind someone. Literally, mm -hmm. egg on the face. Lots of cream mm -hmm. of tartar. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Right. So, leaving the Everfree Forest, what is our next scene? This. We have to go up the mountain. Up the mountain. <laughs> so heroic. We're we're getting close. We're tracking these diamond dogs to the mountain. Go on. <laughs> All right, so coming out of the Everfree Forest, uh, you have closed the gap. You do see them up ahead. Uh, they are on, um, it's a switchback path that leads up to a cave, it looks like. They are a few levels ahead of you, um, but not that far. Mm. Probably, if you keep hurrying, you could probably catch them before they get to the top, but it would cost you another stamina. Hmm. I've got stamina to spend. Me too. I'd yeah. rather I'd rather deal with them now rather than wherever the they're dis wherever they're ending up. Yeah. Okay. Come on, we can't give up now. No. Say as I run. So you you guys start to run and you're catching up to them uh, because you are running. They do notice you, and they seem to be uh, shouting at you as you guys approach. And when you come into range, that you can hear them. You hear, it's ours, you can't have it. We're yes. gonna get it and keep it. Um, well, the comets are for everyone to enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> what he said. It's making people sick. One of also them takes, takes a big sniff. 
Uh, it smells like a big gem to me. You can't have it. What if I trade you a bunch of muffins and cupcakes? We don't want no muffins. Well, Why not? about all of these, and I will produce all of the quartzes and everything that I've collected on the road. Probably add in a couple more shinies that are different colored, you know, maybe like a little bit of sapphire, a little bit of emerald, just mixing it all in so it looks nice and sparkly. I'm going to turn my horn on, so even that's going to have a lot of iridescent sparkle, like, ooh. <laughs> over all of the, the giant <laughs> massive pile of gems that I'm producing right now. So, yeah. I'll help out uh, by tossing in a friendship token and providing some illumination. Nice. All right. Because my horn can glow when I want it to. So you're trying to uh, intimidate Bribe them? them? Bribe them. Bribe them. Bribe them. Entice them. Bribe them with a better with with better stuff. All right, so give me a charm. Okay. Uh, you can try your baking skill. Oh, I can. That's what he said. Sorry, no. Oh. <laughs> it's gonna yeah. say, like, I mean, I can't. Whoa! The sparklies. Yay! Give me the gem roll. <laughs> Eric Demage gave oh! us 300 bits, despite the said sad lack of miniguns and flamethrowers. <laughs> Alright, so I need to do a D6, Eric, you said. Eric, we love you. Alright, um, so... Thank you, Eric. We love you. Who gets those three tokens? Oh. Eric. Yeah, which... Yeah. Decide three people that you want tokens to go to, or you can give them all three to one person. Uh, but uh, we'll yeah. move on or while you decide. Or you can just say... Oh, never mind. Or you can give them all to me. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh... So, um, I'm going to use, uh, Dusty Rune's token of friendship and, um, one of my own so that I can roll a d20 on nice. this mm -hmm. particular roll. Okay. Ooh! 12! Nice. Wow. That was a 12-sided 12, 12 die, too, right? No, that was a d20. Oh, it was a d20. Okay. Mm -hmm. you got a 12. That was a d20. So I am going to roll this against their... Against their what? He's, he's, uh... Their love of gems. <laughs> and their mind... With a boost because of their love of gems. Um, uh, so with a 12, there's a 7, um, they are torn, uh, you can deal 5 stamina to, uh, one of them, or divvy it up to 3 of them, as they are debating your offer, I would but like... it doesn't seem like they are going to take it. I'm, alright, which one is, which one is the alpha? The, the one in the center? I'm going to spend three friendship tokens for an automatic success and use the stare. Ooh. See, I, I just bought that with the... And I said, I'm going to suggest you take... Um, I, I glitter gems uh, if you don't want to get sick. The stare. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You can look. Really look. Oh, yeah. So for those watching at home, the stare is an ability you can get as a pony that it just gives you the ability to just stare somebody down. You give them that look and you're Fluttershy just- Fluttershy does that. Yeah, it, if you're it, a My Little Pony fan, Fluttershy does it. And um, yeah, you know, it's, it's it, no one knew she had that, just like that. Mm -hmm. But she's just like- You give yeah, him, I'm, you give him that look and it's like, it's like, you better do what I say. Or things mm -hmm. are gonna get serious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Pull like the dark wing duck. Let's get dangerous. <laughs> so normally you would roll your stare talent versus their mind talent. Success, they would be frozen, unable to do anything. 
amazing success, which I believe is four or higher, but I'm not positive on that right now, means they would obey simple commands for a short time. Um, and you can only use it on one target per adventure. Hence the alpha. Or the same target once per adventure. Mm -hmm. uh, so bringing in the stare and causing them to get, telling them that they're going to get sick if they keep going at it. Uh, they do kind of hem and haw for a bit more. I will. And then uh, with then, a um, grumble. Yeah, I was going to say if they're, if they're still kind of wondering, then I'm going to split up the stuns between them. So like it has like a, not a bigger of impact on what uh, Dr. Cheerheart is, is doing. Yeah. No, they seem to, the Alpha finally, we don't want to get sick. But the, but the gem, boss, the gem. If, if people dead, are getting sick, if you get we sick, don't want it. You can't put it on your collars. And, uh, and you can't show it he off. He starts to walk back. The other two kind of stop and look back up the, the path until he goes there and grabs them each by the collar and turns around and starts dragging them down. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, that's right. Don't forget your gems. So. Yeah. Make sure you make sure you give it so that at least they don't feel tricked. Good. Exactly. Because then they're gonna come back and be angry. We don't want to deal with that. Good one, cheer hearts. He about this. to threaten you until you handed those back, and he kind of points and opens his mouth and takes some and kind of keeps going. All I right. I threw an extra blue one in there for you. It matches your eyes. Thank oh. you. <laughs> Rhea, Rhea Pal tossed you uh, one of those uh, 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 tokens back, oh. Jules, for Dr. Cheerheart's death stare. Thanks, Rhea Pal. <laughs> Thank you, sweetie. Mwah. Hey. <laughs> and you know what? Those, those, uh, All those tokens that you just spent, all three of them, came from the chat to begin with. So, mm -hmm. so you guys are helping us out a ton. We have yes. already filled up halfway the meter again. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, maybe we'll get a third level out of this. Awesome. Just, hey, I I thought it would be it would worth it. It's just like ah spiders. Okay, I gotta do something to make me feel brave. <laughs> well, it works. It works. Cheer heart. Thanks. I think those guys. Yeah. Are, I think those guys are uh, are convinced. We need to get we need to get moving. Let's go before they change their mind. They're yeah. they're yes. they change their minds. Get past them. We have to get closer. And while they're talking, like I've already started moving forward. My little my amplification device is just guiding me to the gym. And <laughs> all I can think about is I can't wait to see it. I wonder what it looks like. I'm so excited. I hang oh, back I with getting closer. Go ahead. I hang back with whisk cream a little bit, and I say, you know, I do have to say that if we do manage to solve this problem, I am going to be a little bit sad that the that the daytime's going to come back. <laughs> Yeah, the night sky is really I, nice. I but... say, looking at all the stars. <laughs> night sky is all nice, but I mean, the sun can't grow. You know, the sun helps wheat grow, and then if the wheat doesn't grow, I can't have flour, and then. And, and then the I wouldn't be able to have my telescope cake and cupcakes. Exactly. Oh, good point. By the way, who? I and anyway, if you if you gotta sleep, you know, if you get tired, you can't you can't focus on stuff. So you do need some time to sleep. So Fair how, enough. if you're always staring at stuff, you know, you, you got to keep your brain sharp. Then that's why you sleep. Fair that's enough. Why, yeah. Hey, that's why I gave you the milk with the honey. Remember? <laughs> Is my eyes getting bigger and bigger and bigger <laughs> as we get closer? <laughs> She, she's starting the... to vibrate like on yeah. a hyper, like yeah. <laughs> you can just hop towards it. <laughs> I can. It's like I can hear it. It's humming to me. <laughs> I think that anything that's humming to you in your mind. Hold on, I'll be back. Good. Glitter Gem's about it's to break my telescope, and I run up and. <laughs> 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 there is a blue glow emanating from the cave mouth as you get closer to the top of the switchback. Ooh. And you start to hear a, a very low droning chant uh -oh. coming from within. See? Coming to me. Spooky. Let's guys. go. Where's Dusty Rune when we need him? Yeah, yeah where is Dusty? <laughs> 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 oh, did we leave him behind with the dogs? Oh, no. That's okay. They don't like... <laughs> oh, no. He got hit by the stair. <laughs> <laughs> He's just paralyzed. I gotta watch the direction on that thing. <laughs> 
Um, I, I guess I'll, uh, I'll, I'll peek my ear in. Can I, can I discern anything from the chanting, or is it just, like, uh, arcane chanting? It's arcane like, uh... Less arcane chanting and more fanatic chanting. Oh, boy. Oh. Like, are they in there doing, like, hi, jaba, 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 like, circle? <laughs> from this blue glow, there's a shadowing on the wall of the cave next to you. I mean, the cave isn't a straight shot into it, so it kind of curves around a little bit. But you see the blue glow coming out and then some shadowing on the side. Hmm. Ooh. Does it look like a pony? Like the shadow of looks the like thing? looks like several ponies. Oh. The shadows look like several ponies. I wonder if it could, be, it could have been those guys on the rail tracks. Maybe it's a cult. <gasps> Why a cult? here? The cult a of cult. the comet. Cult of the comet. It rhymes even. Cult of the comet. <laughs> it no does. No way. Cult. Oh boy. <laughs> and yeah. I, while we're waiting for Dusty Rune, I found a cookie in my backpack. <laughs> <laughs> You're I'm welcome. Oh been. man, real life cookie. I'm so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> I um, I actually, d <laughs> while I can maybe do something useful, I um, I have a, um, I I literally have a math math and geometry kit that I bought. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you just yank that out. So I'm gonna pull that out. I have you know so many like uh, tools of the trade. Uh, I pull that out and I'm gonna start like trying to look at the the size of the shadows on the wall and the intensity of the light. And I'm gonna try to like use my kit and uh, discern. Um, around the corner, how far away they might be. Okay. Give me a, a mind with the kit. You can upgrade the die roll. If you have a talent that might be applicable, you can roll that as well. Yeah, not really. I I'll just be to... using the mind. <laughs> I'm gonna give him two tokens of friendship and help him out. Assistant. Nice. Thanks, Whisk Cream. No problem. I'm not that smart, but I know numbers. So, does, so that means I'm rolling a d20. Does that mean I'm rolling a d20 now? Yeah, you. Can, you, yeah. you can roll your first one first, and then oh, okay. the d20 after. Okay. First up is a one. <laughs> Good thing I gave you that. <laughs> Holy moly! A 13 is more like it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I imagine, I imagine whisk cream is like, like, no, 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 no. You forgot to. I, this happens to me all the time. You forgot to convert to metric. Yeah. <laughs> sign. yeah. Wait, you're not. Yeah. So sign of the hypotenuse. Yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. CCs is a cubic centimeter. I use metric all the time. I have to. With some triangulation and some measuring of the shadows and the light and the gradation of, of the patterning. You figure that once you get around that corner, you probably have a maybe a fifty-foot opening of a cavern. Hoof, fifty hoof, fifty hoof, <laughs> fifty hoof uh, wide opening of the cavern. And by the shadowing and the patterning, it looks like there's maybe a between half a dozen and a dozen ponies that seem to be uh, moving around. You see the shadowing kind of. Uh, get faded and then disappear as it moves behind the light source as others kind of walk into into the light source and are shadowed then. Hmm. Would we be able to use a ladder to kind of sneak up on them? Do we have a ladder? A ladder. I, I have a ladder. You just have a ladder. I have a ladder and I have got a the magic. Hold on, hold on. I want to hear the explanation for how a ladder is used as a sneaking tool. Yeah, right. well, go on, go on. If, ladder if, if we put the ladder up and then we climb up the ladder, so we're like on the on the top, and then we can like um, I have some rope and we can swing in to the cavern huh? from like the top and then like land right in on top of everything. I can then... fly. For two like... tokens of friendship, I will let you uh, notice that there is a ledge up above you on this cave that seems to lead into that cavern as well, without going around this corner. Uh, I'll See, spend the tokens. <laughs> Since yeah, we're kind of obligated to spend them now that he already gave <laughs> yeah. us the information. <laughs> yeah, right? 
Right. Well, without the ladder, the tokens, the, the without the tokens, the ladder doesn't reach right, and it kind of closes. Oh, I but... see, I see. Okay. <laughs> so you can use the ladder to get up on there. All right. Cool. Cool. Yay. Um, what do you guys think if uh, we are waiting for uh, Cliff to come back? I, I'm not sure what he. Or did he say he was? Uh... Yeah. Um, why don't Why don't we take a, a final break, a uh, quick five minute break? Maybe he'll be back by then. Okay. Seems like we're about to be about yep. to deal with the, some stuff here. Yeah, kind of like the denouement thing. We're coming up on that. Yeah. Mm. Final boss fight. Here, here's the challenge to the chat room. Um, give us a give us a third another level before we uh before we uh. <laughs> have Please have demand it on them. Do it. Wait, do no. it. It was not a de- it was not a demand. Do it now. it was a challenge. Do it now. It's <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I, I don't know. Now I, I can't do an Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> do it. Do it. Do it now. Do it now. Just yeah. do it. Yeah. Make your do dreams it. come Shia true. Love. All right, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm. Uh, I'm turning all these people off, and I'm t- starting our five-minute break. <laughs> we'll, we'll be right back in five minutes, guys. Bye. <laughs>